Hey everyone, welcome back to Shop Life. So today we're going to continue with our car buying addiction by going to buy a $1,500 Suburban. So the Suburban apparently on the ad they say that it needs like some kind of arm or something because it's making a weird noise. It's not drivable, it needs to be towed. But main reason we're trying to go buy a Suburban is for her family. Uh, they're going to be coming to visit and they're going to need a bigger car to drive around. So we're going to buy that. Fix it up. Once they leave, we're gonna go ahead and resell it. So this is also gonna be our first flip in California as well. So we'll try to uh, keep as many. We'll try to make as much videos on it, uh, so that way you guys can see the whole progress of the whole flip and everything that we did to it. So let's go ahead and get. Let's go ahead and go check it out. All right, so we're back at the shop. Uh, we bought the Suburban. So we bought that, uh, it's got, we're not sure what's wrong with it yet. We got it for like 1500 bucks. Nice and cheap. Uh, it's leaking a lot of oil right from the front differential area. And it just, it grinds and pops and stuff whenever you're turning and moving. We're gonna clean all this up. But I mean, it's pretty clean for the most part. Once we bring it in, we'll give you all a walkthrough. Yeah, let's get to cleaning. Yeah. Oh my god. I remember when I was younger, I wanted that in the car. That's good. Everybody could stay occupied. Yeah, for real. Oh. And the AC vents in the back. Wow. It's actually not bad. Let me show you the pop that it makes. Alright, go. Oh. Almost everything on the Suburban works. The issue is the front axle assembly. So that whole front differential, uh, the bearings, the output bearings are all shot and I'm sure something inside is also messed up and that's why it's just dripping fluid. Like I had a drain pan and as soon as I pulled out it started leaking there and all the way out. So, so the front diff, I found the whole assembly for like $250. we will go pick that up tomorrow and then we'll replace it tomorrow and hopefully that's it. If that doesn't solve the issue completely, then we're also going to change the transfer case. And if the transfer case doesn't solve the issue completely, then it's the transmission. We're gonna go ahead and finish up cleaning up and organizing that corner in the shop and some of the other things. That way we could park the Mustang sideways and then bring Selena's car in so we can start testing the LS and doing all that too. And we're gonna go ahead and get rid of the Camaro today. So let's go ahead and get to it.
All right, so moved everything out of the way. Now time to put the car right there. All right, so I got the old one out. This is the bottom section of the old one. You can see the crack right there. There's a big old crack there. And this thing, it rattles. There's something rattling inside. Even when I drained the fluid, as you guys saw on the drain bolt, uh, there was all kinds of metal on it. So I know this is the issue right here. This one's toast. I'm trying to get this new one in, but I'm having a little bit of trouble since I have to get it in at an angle uh, so it fits properly. So, we're about to figure something out and then get it on there. All right, so I just finished putting everything back up on the Suburban. We're about to take it for a spin. All right. Seems good. All right, so as you guys saw in the last clip, we got it running and driving, no more noise. Still needs a lot more maintenance done to it. We're just gonna take care of all of that in the next vlog. As you can see, this is the mess that it made on the floor. And here's the old front differential. But yeah, it is fixed. Now here's the updated total. Let's keep a running total of the whole tab. We bought it for 1,500. Uh, we put in $500 for the front differential, and then it was 170 bucks to get it towed here. So right now we're at 2170. Uh, we'll keep y'all updated with the whole running total so we know how much we have in it and then how much we sell it for. So that's it for this vlog. Thank, thank you everyone for watching. We've been getting a lot of support recently on the vlog channel, as well as my main channel, Shop Life TV, and uh, Selena's main channel, BMW Selena. And we're very grateful for it. And I, I'm very glad that you guys are enjoying these videos. We'll try to continue to make as many as we can. Sorry about not having any Beamers. I know you guys hate American cars. I do too, but. Well, here's one. Two Beamers. Who knows how many outside. 
Let's go check it out. There we go. We have his. We have the M5. We have the 6 Series. <laughs> we have a Lexus. And then we have an M3 that came in today. And another American piece of shit. And the Suburban. Alright, thanks for watching. See you guys in our next vlog. Bye. Let's go.